Yo, what is going on dudes, Arachnitondra47 here, back with another video. As you guys can tell by the title of this video, I'm going to be buying the $1.5 million boat, or that's the spawns right here, uh, in Roblox Mad City. So, I I'm pretty sure this is the most expensive boat in the game. Uh, I checked all of the docks and uh, places that all the other boats spawn, uh, and this seems to be the most expensive one. If there is another one, I I could be wrong on it, but I'm pretty sure. Uh, if there is, let me know, cause I'll uh, I'll buy that one next. I just uh, yeah, I'm not totally sure where those would spawn, cause I checked all of the docks. But uh, yeah, anyways, this looks pretty cool. It has a giant missile launcher on it. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and buy this and check it out. Here we go. Hold E to buy. I would just like to buy the Marauder for 1.5 million. Yes. So here we go. And the interesting thing, and I, I should be on the criminal side to test this actually, because you, you can move the this around, which I'm curious how it works when robbing the boat. Um, actually, first things first, let me go down here to uh, this. I'm going to unfavorite the Hydro and uh, find this. Um, and yes, and add this to my favorites now. So I think the main reason for that was added for adding this was uh, because of the boat. Because I mean, it just it works so well. I mean, you can just shoot them. Uh, it does have 1,200 uh, health, which I also believe is the highest among the boats. Um, the next one I think is the Hydro, which I'm pretty sure is 800. Uh, so yeah, this is pretty cool. Uh, it seems to be pretty fast too. I mean. It's, seems a little bit faster than the Hydra, which is shocking because it's bigger. Um, but yeah, I like that you can control this. Um, tell you what, I'm going to jump over to the uh, the criminal team and we're going to test it out on the boat. Okay, so yeah, here are the, all the cheaper boats. Uh, here, oh wait, I can't fit this vehicle in this location. There we go, okay. Ooh, okay, that just launched me up in the air for some reason. Uh, I gotta get in here and I gotta go quick. So yeah, that's uh, 50k, 100, and, or 500,000 actually. They might, I think they increased that since I bought it. Um, so yeah, all pretty cheap options. So this doesn't turn too well, but none of the boats really do. Um, but anyways, let's go over here. Let's check the map. Uh, I'm, I think I'll make it. I think I'll make it. Uh, We'll see. I mean, I may, maybe I can try to rob it. I don't. I don't think I'll have enough time though, because it's it's kind of already over by where you need to drop the crates off of off at. Uh, so let's try though. Um, so I think if if this um, if this works how I think it's gonna work, I should be able to take out the back two uh, the back two engines both at once. Let's find out here. Oh uh, wait, maybe maybe not actually. Let's let's find out. Yes, okay, so you can. It ooh, it does thirty-five, it looks like. Yes, that's that's not bad, but it's a little slow. It is a little slow, which uh not ideal for taking out the boat. So I mean ooh, th there goes uh some some engine actually it only took out fifty. So I think this takes less damage too, uh compared to the other boats, because usually you take about a hundred, I think. Um so that is cool and ooh, I got the one. I didn't get the other one yet though. And uh, there we go. And yeah, I don't think I have time to take these all out. But this is definitely a cool boat. And this is actually going to help a lot for this. Because, uh, I mean, you could take out a bunch of them. Granted, the boat's probably still going to despawn or going to get destroyed here. Um, and I mean, obviously, I don't have a whole lot of time here to do this. But we'll, uh, we'll try to do it. So as you can see, the little crosshair on it seems to be kind of glitching. Um, I'm not... I think that's because I'm moving while I'm trying to shoot this. Um, but actually, I might be able to take it out here. I don't have any other guns with me, or else I'll jump out and try to take the last one out real quick. Um, I think I'm going to get all but one, actually. Which is annoying. Yeah, because the crosshair is starting to get a little, little weird moving. Um, yeah, if I had just a little bit more time, I could probably do this. But yeah, I, I just jumped in a little too late there. But yeah, it, it, this is definitely a cool boat. I would definitely recommend buy. Yep, here's the unrestricted area. Okay, so here's where I can't go any farther. And this is where I lose it. Um, yeah, okay. So yeah, yeah, I'm definitely going to use this when robbing the boat. Uh, just only slight problem is I jumped in, like I said, too late. Uh, I got all but one. So yeah, it's, it's 
definitely this is this is mainly just going to be used just for this because I mean there's no real other point for boats I mean other than the, the cargo plane but you don't really need this for that uh, but it's interesting because now you can you can take this out uh, take the boat out by yourself now a lot easier too because uh, as you can see I started out with uh, two, oh, 1200 and I'm still at 800 to 825 so didn't take that much damage considering usually the hydro and the DeLorean and all those get destroyed by the time you can take it out so this this is a really good boat um, yeah I, this this is honestly one of the better multi-million dollar vehicles I feel like because even if you don't use it a whole lot, just using that alone, the boat, because I mean, personally, I rob the boat every time it comes out, because if you didn't know, you get up to almost 2,000 XP per robbery, um, so that's, that's obviously really good, uh, and yeah, that's just really ideal to have this now, because before, it was really annoying, because the best, the best, um, the best weapon was like the AK and that took forever to take them out. But yeah, I would definitely recommend buying this. Obviously it does cost a lot of money though. You probably want to get a better vehicle before you buy this, but this is definitely worth it. I would probably buy this over like the Nighthawk, uh, cause I mean, probably over the Nighthawk or the Warhawk now that you can't spawn them in. I mean, those don't seem too, uh, too useful cause like if I go over to the airport, I'm just going to get a helicopter since they're easier to control anyways. But, uh, yeah, this is cool. I definitely do not regret buying this. It's awesome. Uh, but, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end off the video here. I hope you all very much enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and smash that like button if you're new. And I'll talk to you all later. Peace out, dudes.